no, you know what? I, I, I want to surprise people, man. What's happening, because they'll bro? be like, oh, we've never seen Maya behind the wheels, man. No. <laughs> Come on. No. Yeah. Today's actually my first time of being behind the wheels, man. And I know Stickers is so scared. Are you scared, bro? I'm scared, bro. You scared? I I wanted a helmet, but I couldn't get it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I just have to sit. How can you use no just fasten your seatbelt, man? You need you need a helmet for what? You know, I, I always tell stickers that I'm just that guy who drives but I don't want people to know that I drive. <laughs> <laughs> Be, be, it's behind the scene driver, man. I, I, I'm behind the scene driver. driver. Emergency. When, when things happen, I'll be behind the behind the wheels. But mm. if nothing has happened, no, I need to sit in the car and enjoy myself, man. Mm. So I think a lot of people leave a comment saying that, oh, we've never seen you drive. Now, I've been with stickers for how many years? Three years. Three years. And I think he's scared now. Don't worry, bro. You won't die. Man. Chief driver. You won't die. You won't die. You won't. We'll, we'll, we'll be safe, man. <laughs> we'll be safe. But yo, um, where are we going right now? We're heading to Kempinski. Right? We're going to Kempinski, man. Heading to Kempinski. Kempinski, I don't know, I said it in my previous video, yeah? Kempinski is a German name. And Kempinski have my first name. Uh, so I'm called Berthold, which is a German name. And the founder of Kempinski is also called Berthold. So the full name of the owner of Kempinski or the founder of Kempinski is called Berthold Kempinski. And I'm called Bertold Winkler. I don't even know where my dad got that name from. <laughs> you know, when I went to Switzerland, it was so funny. The guy who was coming to pick me up was a German. <laughs> so the guy chose to come and pick me up because he saw the name of my passport being Bertold. So he's like, oh, that's a German. Oh, okay. Now the dude came and then started speaking German, bro. <laughs> he started speaking German and I'm looking at his face like, hey, I'm not German, bro. I just have a German name. But yeah, that was the name given to me by my dad, so it is what it is, man. But we're going to Kempinski to pick up um, a friend of mine. I'll say she's Nigerian, a YouTube representative. I mean, we've been working back and forth for the past year, right? The year, but we've never met each other. It's always been online. I met her yesterday, took her around, and um, she wants to know more about Ghana. She wants to explore Ghana, and as a Ghanaian, Believe me, I don't know where to explore in Ghana. You guys know where to explore in Ghana? So, I just feel like taking her to one of my favorite places. That's like Ibri. Because I, I love being in Ibri. And apart from that, there is also another content creator from South Africa. A YouTuber that talks about finance. This is so cool. Like, I'm waving the South African flag. Yeah. <laughs> She's also in town, just meets the same lady that I'm talking about. <laughs> She's now in Ghana and she's also saying, Maya, I want to explore Ghana. I'm like, okay, you know what? Let's do this. So I'm just going to pick them up and I'm going to be their tour guide for today. And uh, it's a vlog day, man. Don't forget to like the video subscribe and be part of the channel man now let's go man hey chief driver stickers don't be scared man you go straight <laughs> yeah like just go straight. straight just go straight man i trust you but bro ah, come on this guy is just uh, he's acting like a woman no but i don't i know so many people hate to see me drive i don't know i don't know especially stickers oh yeah he's number one enemy I know that. I know that because he's like now. Ah. If mine is behind the wheels, I'm not. I'm not going. I'm not going. But don't worry. This is highway. Is that a highway? Jeez. So what's what's your highest speed? Two hundred, bro. Yo, bro. Two hundred. No, I don't. I don't want to kill you right now, but. Just I'm, crying. This alarm, I'm bro. just crying for this moto guy. If you don't get out, <laughs> no, come on. So now, do you believe now? <laughs> See, is believing. Ah, no, hey, no, 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 no,
I'm, I, I'm so sorry for using the, the Ghana time. Oh, it's okay. Hi. How are you? Thank, Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Hi, how are you? Good to see you. Good morning. Yeah. Morning, how are you? Good. Awesome. Yes. This is my father. Oh, hi. How are you? Good to see you. Yes. Okay. Yes. Snap, snap. <laughs> snap, snap. I, no, I, I need to oh, snap. It's low key. Yeah. Yeah. Low key snapping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you good? Yeah. I'm good. Awesome. Yeah. What are you expecting? I've got an open mind, so let's see. <laughs> I'm expecting nothing. Nothing? It's better when you don't expect no. anything, and then everything is a surprise. Connection and heritage. Yes. Connection and heritage. Now I'm scared. No, I'm scared. Now I'm scared. You should have known with my nothing. <laughs> Ghanaian Nigerian. Yeah. You know we're connected. Exactly. So you know that's what okay. we're gonna vibe off you of that. You should have gone right. with my nothing. No. Vibe off okay. Of that. No. When you expect nothing, everything is a surprise. Uh, that's a very Virgo. Answer. That's a very Virgo. Answer. Right? Yeah, because Virgos don't want to be disappointed. I know. We're I know, but I'm, I'm here for this, it. This, I am this here is for it. more like African Union, man. It is now. It is. Morning. Okay. If you don't have a photo at the Black Star Square, which means that you've never been to Ghana, so I had to do justice to it by taking them to the Independence Square for a photo shoot. Do you want a picture too? Mm, my, my perfect funeral. Oh, what is that? These are like poor bears. If you die, they come and carry your coffin and dance with it. Like you're not African. Come on. Use an umbrella. I'm a picture. You want a picture? Is it locked? Can you unlock it for me for two seconds, please? Thank you. I definitely need my mics also. Oh, nice. So I can connect. Nice with you. Nice with you. Yeah, yeah. Oh. On my way to the top, I met young Ghanaians exhibiting an old school fashion and which I think is super cool. So I had to put them on camera because they actually love my videos. Hello, Mamu. Why are you putting, putting on red? Ah, 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 because no, you guys need to tell me about your outfits for today. Man. What, what's happening? happening? Yeah. That's why I can't see the fact. Upcoming festival. Yeah. Promote yourself, man. I'm vlogging I'm I'm right now. Oh, man. Nice so, I mean, upcoming festival. Oh, wow. I love that. Oh, what's, what's, what's happening? Okay, so we have an upcoming festival. It's yeah. called the Ayalolo Festival. Ayalolo Festival. Yeah. Then, on 6th March, every year, we dress in old school outfits. And then we parade the streets of Africa. We have over thousands of people coming around. Okay. Sorry to interrupt, I know you all are enjoying the episode, but hey, please do me a favor, like this video, it means a lot to me. Can we get 30,000 likes on this video? I mean, like it now! And are you new to the channel? Is it your first time seeing this YouTube channel? Please subscribe, let's hit 2 million subscribers. Hiya! Bye! So one of the places that no tour guide will ever show you or bring you the circle. I've never seen any tour guide bringing their client to circle. But I just want to make circle a tourist destination. So that's why I brought you guys here. Thanks. Are you are you all excited to see circle? Very yeah. excited. Yeah, but one doing. thing, you have to leave your phones in the car. Thank you, Jesus. Hey. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Welcome to Cycle. Welcome. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> that was a good one. Yeah. <laughs> so, it's one of the busy places in Accra. And a market so, it's, it's a market. Combined with transport. Everything. Course, Everything is here. The businesses, and this is actually the center of Accra, and it's named after Kwame Nkrumah. So this place is called Kwame Nkrumah Cycle. So this is an interchange that we have here. Oh wow, Kwame Nkrumah is a great guy, eh? Are you a fan of Kwame Nkrumah? Oh yes. So this is a private transport.
No, no umbrella. <laughs> well, I'm a, I'm a <laughs> Oh, We're Africans. Your this energy. Is our yeah? this is our culture. Where do you want to go? This, this. Who owns these buses? Whose fleet is this? These are individuals, you know. Oh, so you can buy Where into. Yeah. So you you can you can actually own one of this. Oh, oh okay. can I buy one from South yeah, Africa? Yeah, you, from South Africa. And bring it in. Yeah, can I buy course, one from here? Of course, of course, man. If How much do you think it makes in a day? How many I have trips no, does it make? I have no idea. I think we need to find one driver and ask. Yes. My, my dad is obviously asking. Yes. What's your name, sir? My name is Isa. Isa. Yes. My name is Nicolette. I'm coming all the way from South Africa. I'm very, very interested in the spice market and the business. So you as a driver, you tell me, how much does one of these buses make? How many trips does it make in a day? Half, half, half trip. Half trip yes. to where? Kumasi to Accra. Okay. Then you return the next day. And in a full load, how many people is that? 31. 31 people. And they each pay how much? 100 cities. 160? 100 cities. 100 cities. So 100 times 31 is 3,100. 3, yeah. So you make 3,100 cities. Wow. In a day? <laughs> Apart from your fuel? Uh, as you, have to, you, what you deduct fuel. your fuel and everything from yeah. it. Yeah. Oh wow. So, but why do you only make one trip in a day? Half, half a trip? It takes five to six hours. Oh, to fill it Italy. up. Oh, yeah. Five to six hours to the destination. To the destination. Yeah, so that's basically that's Is that how far it is? It's, it's Sheesh, far. That's quite far, hey? You should try it out. So let's do the mathematics. Three, one in a week, three times every day. You go every day? Days? Seven days, yeah. Seven days? Three times seven is what? Twenty... <laughs> Twenty-one! <laughs> Thank that you. That's the financial value. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you see, I literally forgot. That's your channel. That's what your channel is all about. Yes. Man. <laughs> Not bad, eh? Financial. Come on, Freeman. mood. Yes, love so, it. So, content is killing the youth. <laughs> I, what, what if someone grabs the camera? Yeah, actually, is the camera uh, in short? As a financial bunny, I have to ask you if your camera is in short. You have to have a proper risk management strategy for all of your equipment because that's how you build wealth. Hey, how are you? Good. <laughs> I just wanted them to know how it feels to be in Africa. The reason why I'm saying this is that when you go to so many African countries, this is how our market looks like. This is the life of an ordinary African who is hustling to make ends meet. So yeah, I mean, that's why I'm saying that whenever you come to Africa, visit places like this, invest your money in places like this, spend money there because that money will help build Africa. Like this. This is, this is our livelihood. Our livelihood. This is our livelihood. This is, our livelihood. <laughs> this, 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 this is how we make money. This, this is how we grind. This is the hustle. This is the reality of our people. And it's like everything is happening. At everything once, you know? is happening at once. People are trying to survive and make it right here. <laughs> it's our people. It's our yeah. show. <laughs> Africa is open for business. Okay. This is it. Whoa. Don't get better than this. Wanna swim? <laughs> 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 if, if you want to come out as an alien, then yes. <laughs> you want to come out. Oh, this is it. Yeah. Oh, this is it. Say that again. They need to fix this. This is not good. What is it? The sanitation. It's terrible. This needs to be fixed. President, right? President of Ghana, this has to be fixed. This is not good for health. Communicable diseases, all sorts of things. I can imagine what was happening during COVID with this. This is not good. I'm gonna say hello to the babies. Hello. 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 How are you? Hi. Are you good? Give me a high five. Bam, high five. Bam, high five. Bam. Um, I gotta give me a. I wanna give you something. I've got something for you. Who wants a twenty? Who wants a twenty? You gonna do the ABCs for me? Let's go. Are you ready? A. This is A B C D E F G. You know the ABCs? Okay, you're gonna say after me. Let's go. A. Say A. B. C. D. E. 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 F. G. You're so H. Crazy. I. Hey. J. <laughs> K. You're so funny. Okay, there you go. Well done. Yeah. You got Sun Circle is the heart of Ghana. 
that heart contains everything. And believe me, we were not expecting to see a street dance in circle. But hey, it is what it is, man. We had to join and go have fun. Did I tell you that Circle is named after Kwame Nkrumah? So this place is called Kwame Nkrumah Circle or there's an interchange here called Kwame Nkrumah Interchange. So there is a statue that is built to honor Kwame Nkrumah right here. So since I am here, the guy who loves Nkrumah so much, the Nkrumahist, I had to take them to pay respect to a sergeant for Dr. Kwame Nkrumah. But I want to ask you a question. Anytime you see Kwame Nkrumah raising his hand up in the head, what do you think it symbolizes? Leave that as a comment. Freedom is coming to the I've never done even this in Lagos. <laughs> really? Never. Why? Too busy. Too busy? Too busy. Oh. You have to plan. I, I'm, your... I'm so glad I gave you that experience. Oh. That's where the president lives. Oh. So his personal house. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah. Well, at least he's not far away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> From the people. That was so funny. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Time to head to Ebri, but let me tell you one secret. Whenever you travel in Accra, whenever you get stuck in traffic, all you need to do is to support the street hawker by buying something from them. It's normal in Ghana. I don't know about your country. Do you guys have street hawkers, people who sell in traffic? They have an estate not far. We need to support our own, yeah? So anytime that I drink water, I always make sure that it's an African owned. It's rapid response, police. Yeah, so this is our week. Police separate. This area is called the airport city? Yeah. Yeah. And um, it's a private owned. Okay. You can keep it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's a private owned city. So the government, in collaboration with the private sector, um, developed this whole area. So it's just this was actually the first building that was built in here. That one looks abandoned. No, yeah, that one is abandoned because according to um, the video that I did here, the owner is saying that there's not enough car park, so he's not gonna continue. Enough car park, basement, basement. But I think the the basement car park is not enough. Yeah. So it's the whole building is rejected. So. What do you think is the design? Is it the design? What do you think it looks like? That building? The white one. The white? Yeah. Like crossing uh, with the I've Chevron the... signs and all of that. Yeah. Oh, that. it looks like um, a jungle. Or like a net. A net? Uh -huh. Last guess? Like a fruit. Oh, oh pineapple. Pineapple! Oh, yeah. Hey! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I said that. <laughs> 
Huh? All right, let's go. <laughs> Our first stop is the Ayumensa Park, one of my favorite estates in Ghana. You know what? I love to show off. So I had to show off to them that, hey, in Ghana, we've got green estates, even though it's hard to find green estates in Ghana. <laughs> About the estates. It's beautiful. Uh, looks a little bit older though, but it's nice, beautiful. Uh, high quality. So the issue is always uh, maintenance. Yeah, they need a sectional sustainability. Body corporate. Where's body corporate here? Um, but it's nice, very nice mm. indeed. Then how? No question about this. I want to see what happens to you guys. First impression? Oh, it's nice. It's beautiful. It, it needs a body corporate. No, I, I'm, I'm talking about the time that I see people moving in. Okay. Yeah. Whenever you travel with women, yeah? Always make sure that they are comfortable. So, I know we are going to a park, and I know that when we go to the park, we're going to spend more time there, so they won't get the chance to feel comfortable the way they always want to feel. So we had to stop by at the vacationist. And believe me or not, they loved it. Nice to meet you. Hi, Dad. I'm well. How are you doing? Awesome. I'm great. Thank you. Hi, Dad. Nice to meet you. How do you do? Welcome. How do you do? I know if you also come here, you're definitely going to enjoy. Believe me, this is the best place to make babies, man. Right? <laughs> it's like medical babies. So you make, you make a lot of toys here. Yeah. Oh, wow, look at that. <laughs> time yeah okay <laughs> thank you thank you for today helicopter oh, hold one you didn't tell us that part <laughs> let's do it i'm sure there's a story behind the helicopter yeah, definitely. definitely definitely and i have no idea 
but guys, he's, I'm gonna Google it and I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> <laughs> this is a Buri Botanical Gardens, right? Yeah. Okay, so safari. Can we get an understanding of the helicopter? Old. So people come in here for picnics. We think it's something about it being one of the first helicopters in Ghana and was given from the UK. But we could be wrong. <laughs> As well as Trip advisor says that. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. You're Hello, sad. Nana. Hello. <laughs> How are you doing? Smile. Big smile. <laughs> She's like, no. Big smile. First president of Ghana, uh, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah came here with this. Came here. Here with the this. The gardens yes, with this. Yes, and it got spoiled. It never moved again. Oh. Yeah. So that's the story behind it. Yes. So I didn't know. So we've we've just educated. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's go. When you travel with women. You become their photographers. You must lie on the ground so we can see commitment. <laughs> you, you just sit. Yes, <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's it, that's it. Wow. This is not my first time coming to April Gardens, but this is my first time seeing activities going on in the gardens. And I was so happy to see that this initiative was done by a young man. This is Spain's Bolibri. This is my pop-up recreation space. It's in every garden here. You established this yourself? Yeah, eight months ago. Eight months ago? And why you decided to establish something like that in here? Um, I've been coming I'm 28. I've been coming here for a long time and yeah. nothing happens here. It's just the trees. So then when people come, they just have to either do like a walking tour, which lasts like 20 minutes or something. Once they are done, they have to return back to Accra. So then I felt, oh, let me just add these things here. So when people come, they can do a painting session. They can play paintball target shooting. They can play basketball. They can play badminton. There is soft archery. We have even mats that you give us so that you want to play board games. That box over there has about 20 board games, different games. So then wow. people can even do picnics and stuff like that. So wow. that's that's basically what that's we do. That's your own idea. Yeah, yeah. So that's so creative. We operate man. only on weekends and then holidays. Wow. Amazing, man. If you have a message to the youth of Ghana, what would that message be? I just say that when they come here, they patronize Ghanaian tourism and also patronize the Ghanaian business. So it's always a good thing when you come here. It's very low budget as well, so you just come and have fun on a low budget. It's always a great thing to come here. You know, I am an international sniper. Show my boy. Show us. Tell him something. What did I just tell you? Hey. Come on, come on. Give me that. Hey. Yay! Let's go. Come on. Hey. Let's go. Seven, six, eight, over the back. Five, <laughs> four, three. Oh. Go! Yes! Hey! Because <laughs> you missed this shot. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on. 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 Come you did a good job, yeah. He, he, he would have killed somebody. My there. enemies are many. Let's, Let's go. go. Overboard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. No, 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 wait. Wait, wait. wait. Okay, <laughs> let's go, let's go. No, he was just. Hey, hey, hey. Allow me, allow me. Allow, allow, allow. Calm down. Calm allow, down. he was just. You can do this. Uh -huh. Okay, not bad. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This guy, no yeah, one. They don't know you, eh? YouTube is, YouTube is no, good for you. Please, you know, please, you know, hey, this is fucked up, man. <laughs> you can't be a man. Ah. <laughs> Bro. The day is almost over and it's time for food. So I had to take them to Hebrew, which is 10 minutes away from the park. Let us see this Ghana jollof rice. It better be good though. Yeah, be good though. Otherwise we will not live here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Alright. Uh, Daddy, I, I hope you're also gonna order Ghana jollof. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Oh, but we have to make sure it's good though. Uh, uh, if you know good, we'll have a good day here today. <laughs> we will put the leg for one trouser. <laughs> Two legs for one trouser. <laughs> Ghana and Nigeria. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, and South Africa, yeah, South Africa, yeah. South Africa, South Africa. <laughs> this is the real African Union. Yeah. <laughs> Friends. So, so, so I, I guess Ga so Ghana spice. wins, eh? <laughs> I wouldn't say that. We'll no. go that far. <laughs> but it's pretty close. It's given us for a while. Right. <laughs> In a different category. And after eating, Nicolette arranged with a chef of Hebrew to organize us a special cake. Happy, Happy birthday, dear Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Blow it out. No, you're no. both of them. Oh. Both of them. Yes. Okay. Okay. I must blow both of them out. I don't know what I've been told. Come, okay. guys. Sing. That's what I'm saying. Don't you God. worry, don't you scare. Don't worry. Don't worry. It only don't gets don't better don't every year. Okay. Which way you make a wish? Oh. wish? Make sure it's a big one. Are you done? Ah, that okay. was a short wish. <laughs> she knows already. No. She knows what she wants. That was a short wish. <laughs> From your thought yeah, to God's ears. Yes. 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 <laughs> she knew exactly what she wants. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Ice cream, ice cream. Yeah. Don't even thank you. Thank you. Yes, thank you, everyone. I think everyone. Wow. Very. Ego, ego. Akumbo. That's one in that. Is it good? It's very sharp. It's good. It's very sharp. To my surprise, when I was about to leave, the chef came out and said he is a huge fan. Of my life. Uh, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't really have the opportunity to come and see. Ah, uh, yeah, you're one of my superheroes. No. Oh, I'm crying for you. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Such a moment. Such a moment. <laughs> Say it again, say it again. Have you what? He's one of my heroes. Oh. Oh. I can be your hero, baby. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. I can't be my guy. I can't be my guy. I can't be my guy. Let's take a photo, man. I'll stand by you forever. You can take my breath away. I know what they call it. I'm going to feel that Bellera. Today was really fun and I'm so glad I was able to create all these memories with these beautiful people from different parts of the continent and I will be happy to create this moment over and over again. Yeah.